Hey everybody, I'm back. Quick live stream. I don't know if you actually saw this tweet or this photograph, but take a look, okay? That one. Now you would say, hey, that's Dave Cobble. Looks like Dave to me. And you would say, okay, where is he? Well, this was part, this, uh, what you're looking at, of a tweet that was put out by a gentleman by the name of Milton Cardoza. So it's actually a cool name, Milton Cardoza. I love that name, Milton Cardoza. Anyway, here is Mr. Cardoza in his cell shirt, about to board the same Southwest flight, according to his tweet, and perhaps I can enlarge it, that Dave Cobble is on. I'm surprised this didn't make the news. It didn't. Well, it made my news now. But look at this, okay? Milton Cardoza. Let's do a little bit more of this in. All right. And then once more with feeling. All right. When Dave Cobble is on your flight to Vegas, you make sure you're dressed ready for him to walk right in front of you. And that's exactly what Cardoza does. All right. But then look at the responses here. Okay. Look at, I want you to, to, to check a look at this. All right. I hope you made a scene and embarrassed him. Other people waiting to talk to, to a cobble on the flight. That's <laughs> all right. I've got handguns and everything. Richard Hake goes, as any social media vlogger says, and he could have vlogged and he goes, I would have been kicked off that flight. <laughs> Dumb and dumber, all right? Walter Thompson says, I can't imagine stopping online with karma. This is a karma, that's an ad. We're going to need updates on this. Well, I'm giving you one. I'm shocked that Fisher had enough to spring for a Southwest ticket to Las Vegas. Dave Cobble must have gotten comp from the Tropicana. And he's like, okay, none of them, all right? None of them asked the major question. The only question, the magic question, what the heck was Dave Cobble doing on that flight to Las Vegas? Now, this is important. You want to know why, folks? Because how many of you have talked about, oh, the A's are backing out. You've taken any little piece of information and tried to make it legitimate, saying, oh, this means that, well, because it's taking so long, they must be talking with the city and they must be planning you know, an exit strategy not to do Vegas. All right, all this stuff, okay? No. I mean, not not even the case at all. What this should prove to everybody is that the A's are hard at work in planning for a Las Vegas ballpark. And that's why he's getting on the flight wearing one of his trademark polos but not in A's colors, interestingly, in a rust color. Maybe he didn't maybe maybe Dave thought he wouldn't be recognized that way, huh? I mean, that's hilarious. Think about that. But that's what Dave has on, a rust colored shirt. What was he thinking? I don't know. But folks, this means this is posted on July 20th. Just during the time that you all were speculating that this thing wasn't going to happen for the latest set of reasons given. Hey, Scott. Hey, how you doing? That was July 20th. July 20th. Okay. Scott, what do you think this means? I'm open to all answers. I have my answer. Before I close out, I'd like to hear yours. Or see it. What do you think it means? I'll post it. Beer bus, perhaps? I don't know. Don't know who he's traveling with. So I got no answer. All right. I got no answer. But I believe it is related to planning for the ballpark. Ah, Scott says... This doesn't seem unusual to me once he's been traveling there a lot. Exactly. Going back and forth. But isn't it interesting 
then no one on Twitter bothered to speculate or say, hey, you know what? Doesn't it mean that this ballpark thing is still on if he's going back there? I'm just saying. Of course. I just want drawings. I want the dinner table napkins that show me what the ballpark is going to look like. I want information. I'm digging. I'm digging. I'm digging. Yeah. It says, yes, it does. Yeah, see? That's all I wanted to say, Scott. I'll be back for more, though. Subscribe to Zinni62 and bookmark oaklandnewsnowblog.com. Hey, thanks, Scott. Thank you for participating. I can have, I can have awards for that in the future, you know? Oh, wait a minute, Scott. Uh, he says, uh, excuse me. I also think there's a lot going on behind the scenes in the owner's meetings that we're not privy to. I agree. Yeah, I completely agree. Hey, good evening, Scott. Thank you so much. Stay tuned, folks. I've got my eye on it. <laughs> Four eyes now. How about that? All right. See you later.